We're here today with the uh, Jetion. This is the JT66K. I want to walk you through some of the settings, the application itself, and what you can expect from this unit. So let's take a look at that. All right, so going back into the JT66K, uh, right out of the box, this is what you're gonna be getting. Pretty much a handheld thermal imager. Great for screening body temperature. You can mount it on a tripod here. Looking at the unit itself, let me go ahead and show you how it looks here. Uh, notice around it has this nice red rubber coating, again, protecting the unit itself. Right off the bat in the front, you have a light functionality. You can turn this on. So for example, if I go ahead and press the light button here, a couple seconds, it turns on. Again, good if you have some low light conditions. You do have your thermal imaging camera and your visible light camera. These are both in the front. Makes the image nice and sharp, combining both of them. So you're not just relying on a thermal or just on a visual. You have both in one place. Again, that is also configurable on the unit if you wanna just show either or or both. Um, going around the unit, again, that same wrapping carries across. I like the rugged look this has. Uh, notice in the back here has a nice big uh, thermal imaging screen here, nice LCD screen. Um, the buttons themselves, very, very simple. And you do have this standard uh, quarter inch tripod mount. I'm using a little one here to show you this, but very, very sturdy unit overall. At the very top of the unit, let me also mention that you have a USB-C connection and a micro SD card. When you plug this unit into your computer, you can choose to enable two different modes. The first one is pretty much, you can have the just data transfer, so whatever's stored in the unit, anything you capture with the button here. The second one is actually being able to use this as a USB camera. With the Jetty on application, you'll be able to see exactly what's going on in the camera on your computer. So let's go ahead and take a look at that on the machine here.